Alright, good morning everybody. I am out here today on a uh, little river here. Actually, it's the same river as my last uh, video, except I am about 30, 40 miles upstream of it, or downstream of it. Not too far from where it dumps out into the Ohio. So, don't know what we're going to catch today. I've fished here before just from the bank. I've never caught a thing. But I don't have too much time today. I have uh, stuff that I need to get done. I was going to get done yesterday, but I ended up going to the Marshall football game. Uh... So, that was a good time. So, same, same thing as yesterday, just using little teeny tiny tube grubs and whatnot. And just fishing all these cuts and banks and such. Oh, oh, that was a fish. Most likely we're going to be catching little bass again, little little bluegills, maybe a few other fish. And yesterday, or last video, we caught those decent crappie. Maybe we'll see if we can find us some of those. Wipers, stripers. I got my first fish. Appears to be a green sunfish. Man, this sunfish just as soon as this hit the water. Pow! God damn it. There you go. Oh good. Oh, there we go. There you go. A little green sunfish. Alright, we're on the board today. We're on the board. Ooh, not what I want. Not what I want at all. Son of a gun. Alright. Not paying attention. Fish of the day is a uh, bluegill. <sighs> yeah, it's got growths on it. I don't want to touch that. I'm not gonna lie, the uh, this stream is well known for not exactly being the uh, cleanest of streams. I've never eaten anything out of here, that's for sure. But it's all of three minutes from my house. So. Since I don't got much time today, I'd at least like to get out and do some fishing. If it's just for bluegills and stuff. Sunfish and whatnot, I'll be alright with that. I did see a giant uh, school of buffaloes. Couldn't get any of them to bite though. Which kind of sucks. I never caught a buffalo. It's a fish I would like to catch before I leave. It's here today. What do we got? Ooh, a decent sized smallie. That's a good one. Yeah. 
edge. Oh, right in the, right in the tip. <laughs> All right, nice little smallmouth for this stream. There you go, little guy. Finally hit a spot where I got decent fish. Now I'm much, much further. Uh, I, oh. I have gone much further today than I did yesterday. Yesterday I only went about 400 yards, 500 yards, and was uh, catching fish left and right in that video, which is this one. Today, not so much. So we're downstream, like I said, about 30 miles from where I had fished yesterday. Um, I'm not too far from a major metropolitan area. I say major metropolitan area. This is West Virginia. There's no major metropolitan areas here. But uh, this stream, as you can see, just by me moving, is a lot. Uh, the current is much heavier here, much faster here. There goes a blue heron right there. Then upstream up here it's also much sandier down this far much much sandier and it floods a lot more so a lot of these deadfalls and stuff have been here for years because all the smaller deadfalls are all gone they every year they just flood away And I have seen this river, like I said, I have to go over this river every morning to get to work. Uh, I have seen this river about 15, 20 feet higher than it is right now. I'll climb campy. And look at that root system. There's got to be a fish in here somewhere. Hmm. So, as of right now, I know there's five species of fish in this waterway. Uh, the green sunfish, the reg regular sunfish, I'm not sure what species it was. Smallmouth and buffalo, because I saw a pretty big school, probably about 20 individuals up that way. Um, and I know that there are gar here as well. As I have seen them when I've run the trail that's uh, on the side of the river, I see them every once in a while. Not often. But it's one of those, you know they're there. Enough to know that there's, there's gar in this river. Yeah. Touching the bottom, I think. Right before I caught that smallmouth back there, I had a uh, red fox run through the bushes. Tried to get my camera on him, but uh, he was he was he was moving. So, and besides, I don't think my little camera can zoom in that much to really get a good picture of a fox. Definitely, uh, after a few other things, saving up for new GoPro. Gonna get a much better one. What I got here, still gonna use it. Can have multiple angles. Alright? So. so I got another little bass. 
I think these are spider bears, not large mouth. Nice little bass. Almost done with my float. Got some people over there. So I don't want to interrupt their fishing. So I'll head down right over here. Then we'll turn around and paddle back. I got some chickens to feed. I got a paper to submit for school. <sighs> I'll say there's something else I had to do. Hmm. We'll figure it out. So I don't know what kind of. I think, like I said, I don't think these are largemouth. I think these are spotted bass. Man. Look at that one. That's a good one. Fish like that. Alright, that's going to do it for me for today. Remember, like, subscribe, hit that bell, share, all the other stuff. Alright, see you next week.